like gel pads under my eyes this morning. I got them right out of the refrigerator because my dang eyes have been so puffy every morning when I wake up. So I've heard really good things about like gel, like little eye pads or whatever. I think I have them up too high because either that or they're just like pushing on my eye. <laughs> I don't love it. Anyway, it feels really nice except for when I like try to look down then it like pushes into my eyeball. <laughs> But, oh, but whatever. So today is our first like real full day back at home since I left for Tennessee. We got back yesterday around probably 10 or 11. We have no food in the house. I mean, we have a little bit, but we don't have what we need. So I, I keep walking back and forth to the trash can, sorry. But we are gonna, gonna load the boys up and Olivia as soon as everybody wakes up. Um, and then head out to the grocery store. Yay! <laughs> I feel like that's what we do every vlog. But yeah, so we're gonna be heading off to the grocery store here soon. And I am ready because I just saw that Starbucks launched their pumpkin spice and I love pumpkin spice. Um, just like any other basic girl out there or guy, whatever. I love all things fall. everybody my shirt your shirt and all things pumpkin spice, so yay. Olivia wants to show you her shirt. You gonna tell them? You have oatmeal on it. <laughs> what does it say? This girl has heart. Um, Lily. That's what it says. Mm. Good morning. Good morning. How are you this morning, huh? Good morning. Good morning, Molly. Good morning, Molly. I probably should have read how long I'm supposed to leave this on before I put the packaging up. So, what's it say? Leave for 30 minutes. Huh, okay. We could do that. How about a coffee montage, yes? Because uh, I think I'm going to have a cup of regular hot coffee before we go so I can get a cup of iced coffee. Because <laughs> um, mom life and I am tired. So we're going to go ahead and do that. ready and head upstairs to see the bibbids. Good morning. Yeah. Are you dirty? Need your diaper changed? Good morning, mister. Good morning. You go downstairs. You think mama looks silly with her eyes stuff? Does mama look silly? Yeah. All right, let's go. Come on. My hair looks silly. I do. Needed help to get out. Jacob suddenly doesn't like it whenever he has peed or pooped in his diaper. He like holds himself and like basically says, get it off of me. So that's what he's doing right now. You need a new diaper? Come on. Come on, let's go downstairs and get food. Y'all wanna go eat? No. All right, bye-bye. I thought so. All right, let's go. Jacob, turn around. Turn around and scoot down. Come on, let's go. Liv, come downstairs. Let's go. Good. Waffle? 
Waffle? Ba 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 For you, two extras. Uh, so I have somewhat of a list, but I'm going through this funk with food right now. Did you find your sister's oatmeal? Yeah. Okay. Anyway, I'm going through this funk with food right now where like literally nothing sounds good. Not even like bad stuff. Nothing sounds good. Pizza doesn't sound good. Uh, pasta doesn't sound good. Nothing really sounds great. And I like have to make this grocery list so that we can go grocery shopping. And um, I'm struggling because like I said, because nothing sounds good, so. Are you guys done trying to take me serious with these on yet? <laughs> I'm about to take them off, I think. My room is a disaster of like to unpack all of this from our trip. But yeah, I'm feeling productive today, so I'm gonna try to get it done while, while I have the energy to do it. But right now, I'm just going to slide some blue jeans on so that I can go to the store. Only water. You know you have boys whenever you hear walking and consistent farting. <laughs> Pooting, tooting, whatever you prefer, sorry. Alright, y'all ready? I don't know, I feel like I still have a pretty big bag under there. But I don't feel as swollen as I did. So that's a win. I'm going to put on a little bit of makeup and then I'll see you guys after because my camera is struggling to hang out with us. Okay, well, we are in the car. <laughs> the AC is blasting because it's so hot outside, but we are headed out the door. Well, we're headed out the driveway to go get groceries. I have a really cranky baby behind me. I'm starving, like sick hungry. So I'm probably gonna stop and get myself some breakfast. The kids already ate and then uh, it's grocery time. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and head out. But. You wanna see what? Yeah, Gouda Gouda sandwich. Olivia wants to see my Gouda Gouda sandwich. She wants to see my bacon and Gouda sandwich, which is hilarious. She just randomly started saying, I wanna see your Gouda Gouda, mom. I wanna see your Gouda Gouda. And I was like, what is a Gouda Gouda? Anyway, um, let me set you guys up here. So I just th drove through Starbucks and got the first pumpkin spice latte, or pumpkin spice coffee of the year for me. Um, I just got cold brew with pumpkin spice flavor. Uh, and I already had a sip and it's not as good as I remember. I definitely like what I've been getting better, but it's still really good. Mama, can I get out? Oh wait, no, I stirred it. It's really good. I like it. Okay. No baby, we're about to get, we're about to head over to the grocery store. I just wanted to talk to friends and eat my sandwich real fast. Is that okay? Can any of you other parents relate to telling your kids that the things you don't want to share are too spicy? Because I can't relate. Actually, I can relate. All right. We're going to drive to Aldi. Eat this on the way. Let me try it. No. You already ate your breakfast. No, I want to try it. It's so hot. Oh no, you guys fell. I don't even know when that happened. Oh well, probably when I closed one of the doors. You get the gist. It's me versus three kids, putting them in the buggy. We're about to walk inside. All right, are y'all ready? Yeah. Ready? 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 Let's go. 
like grocery carts in the parking lot like we always have to get the um the buggy that has like the little race car on the front and then the cart with the two seats up where i am pushing because olivia likes to sit in the car and the boys sit in the like two seats <coughs> but they don't have one in here which means i have to get all three kids out and walk them all inside and then look for a buggy and if they don't have one then i have to use our other like buggy bench. Mommy, mommy, I want to get on the top. Wish me luck. All right, are y'all gonna behave? Are you gonna be good? No yelling, no crazy driving. Are you gonna be good for me? Yeah, and, and I get a chocolate cake pop, guys. I'm getting a chocolate cake pop. Can my friend have a pink cake pop? A pink cake pop? They can't have one. I don't think so. They like it. They like cake pop. Do they? Yes. Yeah. They, they want pink. Mommy, I'm good to get a chocolate cake pop. Oh. <laughs> and, and, my, and my friends are getting a pink cake pop. A pink cake pop. All right, we made it inside. We found a buggy, the last one. Y'all, it is blazing hot outside. We just finished up in Kroger. Olivia's trying to figure out her seatbelt. Can you please put your seatbelt on? <laughs> Hurry up, show everybody how you can do it. I don't know why I even try. <laughs> Show me your new giraffe. Got a little cute little giraffe. Oh, his name is Peaches. And this guy's name is Melvin or Marvin. I can't remember. Coffee number two, Taylor Swift. I'm living my best life, you guys. Okay, I'm gonna do this as fast as I can because I have three hungry children. So, we have four avocados, pasta sauce, sauerkraut, two of these squeezy juice things that Olivia likes, yogurt, life cereal, dino nuggets, turkey bacon, two different kinds of deli meat, some bone broth packets, some ketchup, zucchini, cilantro, pork tenderloin, a Thomas the Train juice. We got a little, little giraffe named Peaches. Hi guys. Two different kinds of applesauce pouches, a huge thing of blueberries, a bag of grapes, some sugar snap peas, some green onions, two of these cucumbers, tomatoes, spray and wash, two red onions, two things of ground turkey, one jalapeno, one bushel of bananas, two of these watermelon kombuchas, because if you haven't, you should. Half and half white rotini. I got this green shirt which is exactly like the one I'm wearing right now because it's the most comfortable shirt I own. Salad green, two of these baskets, but you are currently sitting on one of them. Milk, bread, and last but not least, a big thing of paper towels. Uh, if you have not tried all these Boulder brand paper towels, they are the bomb. And they're cheap. And that's it. Help me, help me mama, help me. And now I'm gonna help this one open up her juice and then I'm gonna make everybody some lunch. Are you hungry, buddy? Yeah? Hungry? You want applesauce while you wait? Okay, so I unloaded all the groceries and I was like just looking around my house and I have this like random urge to reorganize my life. Jameson, can you not? So anyway, I picked this box out of the garage and I have just been going around the house and like putting random junk in it that doesn't have a good place. And then after I'm done, I'm going to go through the box and if there isn't a place for it, it's getting thrown away or donated. So yeah, it's an airplane. It doesn't roll. Hey, can you please get down? Come on, let's hop down. So that's where we are right now. Like this area over here tends to 
like collect clutter it needs to be dusted real bad um but this is just like such an awkward corner in our kitchen so i really want to just like clean it out i need to clean up all this this is from cleaning out the refrigerator after getting um groceries but yeah i just want to have like a clear clean space and i want everything to have a place i think i like want to live more minimally so those two baskets that i got from um aldi I put our diapers in one, which looks like somebody's been over here playing with this, but um, I usually have a diaper basket, which I've been using this for like two years now, but I wanted to have something more chic looking. And then I put all of our extra books that were just kind of like stacked here, right here, and it's also hiding like a lot of our cords and whatever. Um, and then here's like my oil collection, which I don't love. I think it looks really cluttered, but it's what we've got right now. And then like up here is just whatever. Like it also needs to be fixed. And then on the bottom is just like toys. And I wanna figure out this situation too. Mama is tired of seeing toys everywhere. As they dump everything on the floor. I've crashed. I'm tired. So if you liked today's video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a big thumbs down. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button along with the notification bell so you can get notified when we do upload. And we will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye, guys, she says.